channel. If you are new here, hi, I'm Lauren and I upload videos three times a week, Wednesdays, Friday and Sunday. Excuse the way I look right now, everything will be explained in this video anyway. But this video is my skincare using revolution products. So if you want to see what kind of products I use or how to use them and if they are brilliant or worth your money, then please keep watching. So quickly, I just want to do a little disclaimer. Revolution is not being sponsored by this video whatsoever. I have paid all of these products on myself and no, none of these products were sponsored by Revolution or the Revolution did not pay for any of these products that I'm about to use. So if you guys have actually seen my Revolution Beauty haul, then you guys will know what kind of products that I'm about to use and show you guys. But if not, don't worry, everything will be explained in this video and I will leave all the links down below for you guys as well. So, excuse the headband, I've just put it up so it can keep all my hair out of my face right now so I don't want to get any hair in all the creams and lotions and everything else. Um, this is just a queen headband. Um, I think I got it from Primark a couple of years ago. So I don't know if Primark still do them anymore, but it is a really, really nice headband. So I'm gonna show you all the products that I'm gonna use. Again, if you have seen my Revolution Beauty haul, then you guys will know what kind of products I'm about to use. Please excuse the echo in this room. It's where the only bathroom is and it's very echoey, so I do apologize for that. And I do apologize if you hear any noises in the background. I do have my washing machine on, but I have closed all the doors, so hopefully you do not hear any kind of noises from the washing machine throughout this video. So, I have bought, um, I have purchased myself some cleansing face cloths. So these are the Revolution 3 Microfiber Face Cloths. I thought I will buy them because of the purpose of this video. Plus, I need some more face cloths as well. So, little purchase won't hurt. So, I got three in here in a pack and they are so, so soft. I will open them up for you guys. They are beautiful. They are nice white face cloths. They feel so nice and soft as well. I absolutely love the feel of these. So, I will find out for you through this video if they are definitely worth the money. But the, the feel of them are so soft and I love the feel. They're so nice. Then I have a toner. So, this is the Revolution Rose Tonic Toner with Vitamin E Extract. It smells incredible. But, throughout this video, I will let you guys know if it is worth your money and if, if, if it is brilliant for your skin or not. Then I have got the Revolution Vitamin C Cream Cleanser. I will be using this first. I will link everything down below for you guys, just in case you guys want to check them out for yourself, if they are worth your money. But yeah, I saw this all over the Revolution website and I thought, you know what, I'm going to grab my hands on one and see what they're like. Top things throughout I'm going to use is this. This is the Revolution Skincare London 10%. I am not going to even try and say this word because it is such a long word, but I will show you guys in a minute. Plus 1% zinc. This is the Blemish and Pore Refining Serum. So I'll bring it closer so you guys can see what the actual name is. I'm not going to even try and say it because I'll probably end up saying it completely wrong. Um, but yeah, I actually packed these. Well, not these ones exactly. I packed the blue ones. Um, but this is what the bottle looks like. And it does have a little pipette as well, which I absolutely love. So I'll be putting a couple of drops. I might, I don't know whether to put a couple of drops in my moisturiser or just put it on my skin, but we will see throughout this video. And last but I'm using is this AHA Smoothing Intense Moisturiser Lotion. And it is for re resurfacing and refines. And it's re vegan free and cruelty free as well. Bring up guys close if you see you can just have a look for yourself but like i said all the links of the products will be in the description box below for you guys as well just in case you guys would like to check them out for yourself so first things first i'm going to do is cleanse my face so i'm literally in front of the tap right now i do have a mirror in front of me as well so if you see me constantly do this then that's why and i do have a mirror beside me as well 
So yeah, and I'm going to try and use the viewfinder, but let's see what happens throughout this video. You guys are currently balancing, well you're on a tripod, but you're currently balancing on our sink. So hopefully no splashes or nothing moves. So let's just see how this goes, shall we? So first things first is I'm going to do is I'm going to cleanse my face. So I'm just going to wet me face cloth. And I always use cold water. It always wakes you up first thing in the morning or last thing at night. It always wakes you up. Plus it opens your pores a little bit as well. So I'm just going to go over my face, make sure my face is all wet, ready for when the cleanser goes on. Um, first time I'm ever using these, by the way, guys. And they feel absolutely really nice and soft, actually. They don't feel rough against your skin. They feel so nice and soft. Yeah, so I think I might have to go and purchase some more of these to keep topped up because I do have like makeup stains and stuff. If you guys know any kind of kind of products or anything to get rid of makeup stains off face cloths, then please let me know because they do come in handy. I've just wet my face and now I'm just going to wet my hands so I can place the cleanser on. So I'm using the vitamin C cleanser. Like I said, I've only just started using these products while I bought them. So let's see what they're like, shall we? Oh, it smells quite nice. It smells really nice, actually. So I'm just placing this all over my face. I'm still trying to grab my hands on the Freo um, that kind of massages you. All your, like, your cleansers and everything all into your skin for you. So you don't have to do it. But This cleanser actually smells incredible. Oh, it's so nice. It's not thick. It's not textured as well. And it is so nice. It feels nice on my skin as well. Like where they're all cruelty free and everything else and vegan free. Like it feels so nice on my skin. It don't feel like it's burning or, or itchy. It feels so nice. So I'm just going to rinse my hands. Just going to wet my cloth again. Like I said, it feels so nice against my skin. And I think I might have to get that from now on. I've got a bit of a redness on my nose though. It's because I've been really itchy lately on my nose. Oh, that smells incredible. Literally does smell incredible, guys. I highly recommend that. That really does smell absolutely incredible. It goes on your skin quite nice. There's no, like, itchiness or anything. It's all cruelty-free, vegan-free. So it's all natural for your skin. Oh, it feels so, so nice. There is no redness, apart from at my nose, but I always get redness near my nose anyway. But apart from that, there's no other redness on my face at all, which you guys can see that I've got like redness a little bit there. It's where I normally get red anyway, but yeah, other than that, it, there's no redness at all and it feels in really, really incredible. So I'm just gonna rinse the rest of the cleanser off my face cloth. So next is, I'm gonna go in is with the toner as well. Toner, I'm not gonna use the wet cloth because I just use that for my cleanser. I don't know about you guys, but I use different cloths for different things, just to stop all germs and everything. If they all do get washed, don't worry. I do wash every single cloth. But I normally use like um, the cotton pads from Primark but where my nearest Primark is in Chatham and I just haven't got the money to just go there at the moment so I just use face cloths so again I just got a new clean face cloth out of the pack and I'm just going to go in with my cleanser so again this is the first time I'm using it since purchasing it so I'm just going to put a few dubs all over my cleanser cleanser all over my face cloth so I've just put Oh, that, oh my God, that smells absolutely incredible. Absolutely incredible. So I'm just going to go over 
my face with the toner. Again, I do apologise if you can hear the washing machine going. Oh, that smells so nice. If I don't know how to describe it, but if you like the smell of like roses, then you guys will absolutely love this. If I didn't like a product, I'm just gonna put it out there now. If I didn't like a product, I would literally say, "Oh my god, I don't like it. It's no good for me." Blah blah blah. But so far, I'm absolutely loving these products. For those of you who know me, you guys know that I do hate things. I do love things, you know. And Revolution, I love anyway. I absolutely love all their makeup, all their products, everything. I just absolutely love them. But going over my face with the tonic, um, is it tonic in it? Yeah, the rose tonic is absolutely incredible. It smells incredible. And it has made my skin feel so smooth and so soft. Oh, it's just so nice. I'm absolutely, I'm literally going to buy more of that. It is so nice. I'm just going to make sure it's keep topped up. Again, it's cruelty free and vegan free as well. So they are all very handy and very good for your skin. Then last but not least, I've got two things left. So I think I might go for the serum first and then put the moisturiser on. So this is the Blemish and Pore Refining Serum. Again, vegan and cruelty free. And it comes with its own pipette. So what I'm going to do is fill up the pipette. Put, I'm going to have to look in the mirror for this, guys. Put some on my face there. All over my cheeks. I think it's where I've just used the rose tonic for the very first time and my skin's like, oh my god, what's going on? I've just, where I've just used that rose tonic, for the very first time, my skin's like, oh my God, what's going on? What's she putting on me? And um, I've gone a little bit red, just a little bit. I think it's because where I've never used anything like that before, um, my skin's probably thinking, oh my God, what's she putting on me? You know, but the more I use it, I'm, I'm not gonna stop using it just because I'm a little bit red, you know? It's just because it's a new product serum by the way guys it goes on really really well i think i've put a little bit too much on to be honest with you um but i didn't want it to not be covered if you guys know what i mean but the serum goes on really really well it's not so runny at all you put some on your face and it kind of like do you know like the kind of um kind of an o picture on the lips sort of thing where it looks like it's dripping that's what it looks like and feels like it feels incredible goes on nice and smoothly nice and soft as well to get the neck area roll yeah like i said i'm a little bit red it's because i'm using all new products um if you guys want me to do this video again say like in a couple of months um just to see what my skin turns out like after using these products after a couple of months then please let me know and I will do that. If there's any other skincare videos that you guys would like to see as well, then let me know. I would be interested in doing that as well. But yeah, that serum goes on so nicely, so nice and smooth. It's absolutely nice. And I love it. Like I said, look, I'm going to come closer. I'm a little bit red. I don't know if you guys can actually see that. But I'm a little bit red where I'm using all new products and I've never used them before. My skin's probably like, what the hell is going on? My headband is actually falling off my head. Sorry if it's slipping or anything. Then last but not least, I'm gonna use this moisturizer. So this is the AHA Smoothing Intense Moisturizer Lotion. So I'm just going to pop a little bit on my hands because I don't want my face covered in moisturizer. Oh, the smell of this is absolutely incredible. So I'm just gonna, oh. I think I put a little bit too much on my hands, to be honest with you. But I will try and massage that in pretty much. Oh my god, the smell of that is absolutely amazing. It's absolutely incredible. It's not sticky at all. It glides on your face so nicely. It glides on your face so nicely, and 
it's so nice and smooth as well. Oh my god. The smell of that as well guys, if you love any lotions that has a really nice smell to, then I highly recommend this because it smells absolutely incredible. Again, it's vegan and cruelty free as well. Um, as for, I'm a little bit red around my nose, but I'm always red around my nose. I'm not exactly that red around the face, only a little bit. I've got a little bit blotchy up here on the forehead, a little bit around the cheeks area. Yeah, I've just got a little bit blotchy. I think it's because where it's all new products, I've never used it all before. Um, first time trying it all out as well. So maybe it might calm down after a while. After getting too used to all the products and everything else that's inside the actual products itself. But other than that, yeah, it's starting to calm down a little bit now. Um, apart from my nose and a little bit of my T-zone. Um, it's starting to calm down a little bit. Look, if I come close, I don't know if you guys can actually see. Um, but I've gone red. Okay, sorry about that guys, just had to get the door. Um, I've just left it a few minutes just to let the moisturiser seep into my skin so I can give you guys the proper kind of information. And it has kind of died down now. It's only been a couple of minutes, mind you. Um, I'm not so red anymore. The redness there has now disappeared. Obviously, I get, still get redness around my nose, but nothing is absolutely changed. It is absolutely incredible. The moisturiser feels so nice. And my skin it feels nice and soft and smooth so I highly recommend any of these products that I have been using including the face cloths as well I have only used two out of the three the wet one and obviously the toner one that they will have a nice good wash don't worry about that guys um, but yeah I highly recommend everything that I use in these products everything that I use will be in the description box below for you guys as well so you guys can go and purchase them yourself if you are interested so that is going to wrap up today's video so if you have enjoyed this kind of video give it a great big thumbs up don't forget to subscribe don't forget to click on the notification bell as well next to it so you're notified every time i upload if you want any more kind of these videos then please let me know in the comment section below please excuse my hair at the moment i've just taken off my headband just to give you guys a little bit more about the skincare but if you want to see more kind of products from revolution or more skincare products or even a night care like a nighttime kind of care product then please let me know so if you do if, if you have enjoyed this video give it a great big thumbs up don't forget to subscribe don't forget to click on the notification bell next to it so you're notified every time i upload i love you guys so so much please stay safe and see you in the next video bye guys